Vision has ever seen. Rhea Ripley. The Eradicator is here. The following is a last woman standing match. Making her way to the ring. Crowd and representing the Judgment Day from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan. Don't let the bubbly personality fool you. The WWE Universe loves a last man standing match, but they take a toll on these superstars. I can tell you that. That's a true point, Byron. Many superstars have been unable to compete in events for weeks, even months after a last man standing match due to the toll it's taken on their body. But the flip side of that coin is a victory here could propel the winner into a stratosphere they've never seen before. Hey, you've always been a glass half full kind of guy, haven't you, Cole? And that one misses the mark. Not a spinning back elbow call. Thunderous club comes down. Very effective. And she knew Ripley's game plan. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. She has swift justice in mind. Going for the kendo stick like that. She was clearly waiting for that. Got to find a way to get out of this. Oh, my goodness. Byron, what does a competitor have to do to keep their opponent down for the 10 count? You have to level your opponent with heavy offense and stay on the attack. The more times an opponent gets up, the more chances they have to fight back. Yeah, these superstars are going to be pushed to lengths they've never been to before. Oof! Kick finds it. Ooh, what a four club. <laughs> up and around, it took a world slam. The fatigue is setting in for her. A vicious attack by Ripley, putting that wicked streak to work. More than time, that one well. Scoop slam, making it look easy. Firm control. Oh, man! Ouch. Able to answer the count. It's not over yet. Oh, what a clubbing blow. We are getting everyone in attendance to rally behind her. And she's able to get to her feet. You have to admire her perseverance. Oh, and she turns it around. As their opponent face first into their own boot. Drop kick! Great athleticism. They are fading off the WWE fans, now pinning the arm down, and, and a series of vicious stomps. You can feel the resentment building with each stomp there. And another just non-stop aggression. Stop it away. Ugh, I don't have you seeing stars. And repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. Just a barrage of stomps. Incoming. There was nothing but malice behind that offense from Ripley. And you can just feel the contempt, the venom these superstars have for each other. It's been fueling them for weeks, and they show no signs of slowing down. No signs of slowing down, even though they absolutely should. Rivalries like this, they, they never end well for either party. Boom, right across the small of the back. Impressive.
aggressive assault from Rhea Ripley. Impressive sequence by Ripley. And there's seven. It's getting close. Quick thinking pays off. Liv isn't taking this line down anymore. It's time for Liv to take advantage of the misstep and take command. She's feeling the hurt here. With a two-on-one face breaker. And Liv is going to work. You can't take your eyes off Morgan when she gets going. Jumping complete shot. This is the most opportune time to be looking for the fans' praise. Getting close to 10 here. Now you gotta dig deep. Oh, well scouted by Ripley. Kick to the gut by Ripley. Final by Rip time. Morgan is completely out of it. Response from the nightmare to the WWE Universe. Oh man, the referee just counted to seven. And this match will continue. Man, there is no quit. Ooh, what a forearm club. And Rhea is revving this crowd up. Why is she still boasting around? She's in a fight for goodness sake. Rhea Ripley turning up the intimidation factor. That's seven. We may be getting to the end. And somehow, some way, she breaks the count. Just a tremendous amount of heart on display in this matchup. Oh! Strikes with a kick. She's in the ring now. And that'll stop the count. This match continues on. She's looking for something under the ring to even her odds here. And you know she means business since she went with the sledgehammer. Ooh, look, he's using to let her get into her head. Able to parry that one. She rises to stop the count. She's not finished, not just yet. Morgan gets intercepted here. from the nightmare to the WWE Universe. And there's seven. This is not good. Quick return to the ring. Ooh, she responds with a counter. Uh-oh. What a hurricanrana. WWE Universe behind her. And Rhea on the wrong end of some aggression there. The longer the match goes on, the more damage they will endure just to be the last man standing. She's saying, you want it? Come and get it. We will go on. Got the start. Sledgehammer. Oh no. Driving down with the sledgehammer. Liv's been bringing a lot of fire. We know she won't go out quietly. The passion on display cannot be understated. And give Rhea credit for meeting her full force. Driven down face first. Is this really it? And that will do it. Not getting up from that one, so it's called. Here is your winner.
Here. Oh, forget Rhea. about paddling to the WWE Rhea. Universe. That should keep her head in the game. And Rhea Ripley showing no remorse about defeating her former friend, Liv Morgan. This is a big girl's game, and you can't let emotion get in the way of it. There's an important lesson for Liv Morgan to learn here if she's smart enough to learn it. And it turns out Rhea is a damn good teacher. The following champion versus champion contest is a ladder match and is for the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. Introducing the challenger from London, England, weighing in at 231 pounds, the WWE Undisputed European Champion. Three than most of the locker room combined. And introducing the champion representing the OC from Games. It doesn't get any bigger than this, and these superstars know it. That they do, Byron. The richest prize in our sport today, the undisputed WWE Universal Championship, is up for grabs here tonight. Into the corner now. Taking it outside the ring now. And now gets tossed into the ring. Pressing the foot to the back of the head, and then a stop. Standing shooting star press, incredible. A display of quickness, and you can bet that got the champ's attention. Clearly waiting for that. Wow, what an arm drag. Up handle applied into a gut buster. Nice. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. He'll take things into the ring. Wow, what a drop kick. Well, some might call that showing off, but what a display. What a way to flaunt your abilities. Byron, what can be the deciding factor when this type of match goes beyond a one-on-one -on -one encounter? Well, climbing up the ladder can be challenging enough, but doing that when several competitors are trying to do the same thing requires a heightened level of awareness. Superstar needs to be careful since they can fall victim to an ambush from any angle. That's especially the case in an environment like this where it's every superstar for themselves. In a sidewalk slam. Oh, the hits adding up a little on the champ. He's back into the ring. So what's he open to find down there? No matter which way he uses that ladder, there's going to be a crash. the floor. I don't care how bold you are, missing on those kind of maneuvers will send you to a medical facility. A medical attention might be needed out here. That was a nasty landing. And the end is within reach here for one of these superstars. Guys, I'll be amazed if this is where the match ends. You and me both. And they're taking the fight to the sky. This is insane. A counter answered by another counter. Oh, be careful up there. He's fighting to stay alive here, guys. Scratching and clawing. The fight continues high above the ring. No, 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 no. You gotta be kidding me. Leaping from the ladder is no simple task. Fear be damned. Destruction is on the menu. Phenomenal blitz. Momentum really on AJ's side now. The phenomenal one is holding nothing back. Styles has the calf crusher! Styles has the calf crusher! 
Enforcer. Are you kidding me? Oh, elbow. What a counter. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. You might get caught. Climb. Go for it. Climb. Heading up the ladder now. This could be the beginning of the end. This is it. He could do it right here. It seems a bit early to be going for the win, if you ask me. Not if they can win it right here, though. You got to wonder what he's thinking here, guys. I don't know what he is thinking. Throwing Haymakers 15 feet above the canvas. These two just don't care. He's going after him up there now, guys. Not a safe place to be. Reversal on top of reversal. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Hang it. This is no. Uh -oh. of the shots you don't take, right? Yeah, but when you miss a shot, you don't usually fall 15 feet. Here we go. Making that all an important climb up the ladder. I think this is it. Knife edge chop way up in the sky. Dangerous territory up there, guys. I think. He'll need to hurry up if he wants to grab it and get the win. Ooh, I'm having some trouble getting it down. to unhook here. Victory is within reach. No time to waste. Got it. And the champ adds to their legacy. Here is your winner. And the undisputed WWE Universal Lines. Is a hell in a cell match. Making his way to the ring, representing the bloodline from Option. Pensacola, Florida. But to acknowledge at him. And 65 pounds, Roman Reigns. Three plus years at the top of WWE for this. There's a reason this structure is called the Devil's Playground. The cell is carnal, wicked, and uncivilized. One of the most cruel, unforgiving structures ever devised. The cell will break bones. It will shred flesh. It will change careers permanently. Put into the corner now. Reigns turns that around. Kick to the gut. Clubbing blow to the back. 
Okay, this is just a little bit dirty. It's very effective, though. Oh, look at this. Headbutt! He can pin his opponent right here. And he breaks the count quickly. Not getting the two at this point has got to say something. Now on the outside, right by those cell walls. He climbs into the ring. Oh, Roman Reigns about to put his opponent away. No get. That's going to keep Sokoa down. Cover. Two. Amazing. I'm pretty sure everyone in the building thought that was going to be the end of it. But... Roman Reigns, he's going to put him away. No get. No get. by Reigns. He must have had that scouting. Rearing way back. Someone on Spike. Sikola might have just finished things. No, oh, he kicked it out. Holy moly. Reigns' is toughness on display with that kick out. You got to imagine this match has a different complexion after what we just saw. This has become a monumental struggle for these competitors. It is down to who still has the energy, the resolve, to put the pedal to the metal. Setting foot in the ring now. Close line! Well, that'll leave a mark. Ooh! Scoreboy takedown. Oh, no, wait a minute. Powerbomb! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, saw it coming and swept the leg. Oh no, trapping the arm. A vicious stomps to the hand. He reverses it. Snapmare delivered by Reigns and a oh, big boot. Shoulder tackle in the corner. My God, enough! Oh no! Stun gun! Reigns has identified the target. Stand spear! Wow, Reigns nailed. win inside hell in a cell here is your winner roman Reigns. consider this an unexpected loss for solo sokoa call it the most predictable result in all of wwe just pure dominance from reigns
and his opponent from Columbia, South Carolina, weighing in at 205 pounds, Trick Williams. Trick. Here we go, no holds barred. This match is usually only reserved for the most hostile of rivalries. Rage has clouded their vision, and now they're only focused on unadulterated devastation. Let's hope the local medical facility is prepared for the aftermath of this match. Across the top rope. Springboard. Come on. He can do it here. And he gets the shoulder up before two. Starting to see the tolls of this match add up. Just disrespectful. That's gonna fire you up with anger. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Trap the arm. To the neck breaker. And Hayes is in command. Carmelo is just unloading attacks. They're slamming their face down. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. A steel chair? Something we all know could be a devastating weapon. No disqualifications has to benefit a certain type of superstar more than others, doesn't it, Corey? Get off your high horse, Cole. A no disqualifications match benefits the superstar who's smarter, faster, and better. Using the rules to your advantage doesn't make you the villain here. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Hayes now on the offensive. Springboard clothesline! And if this is sink or swim, Williams clearly just did the latter. Yeah, as Hayes was giving him a bitter taste of his impressive offense. Oh, sharp knee! And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Up high, cross body. And into the count. And a shoulder in the air. He's not even close to being done yet. Both knees into the face. Carmelo looking as smooth as he is powerful. That's got to be it. Two. Digging deep for a kick out. Now is not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Wow, springboard attack. Williams looking unable to get a leg up in this match. Williams having trouble getting his bearings. He turns it around. Williams might. Looking for a suplex here to set up a cutter. Taken down with his own move. Amazing. Two count kick out. I thought it was finished off for sure. This man can withstand anything to survive the page torn from his own playbook. All that work, all these big moves, and it still didn't earn the fall. Crank in the head. The oh, wicked kick to the lower back. He is looking to do some serious harm. And this one might be headed ringside. So much torque on the knee and ankle. Oh, belly stop. Oh. Looking for a little bit of high risk here. It's from the top. Look out below. And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. With surprising accuracy. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Looks like Trick has taken the upper hand. Trick showing that edge, that ruthlessness. And he slides him back to the mat. Hoping to end it here. No, he gets the shoulder. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Uh-oh. New 
what Trick had coming. Carmelo's finally able to slow all that incoming offense. Hayes was being tested and was finally able to get some offense of his own in. Cover! Two! Breaks the count. I didn't think we'd see a kick out there. And Mello and Trick are giving us a show. When you know your opponent as well as they do, you have to use everything in your bag. Mello and Trick are leaving. Trick off the ropes. And throws it down with a slam dunk. Trick nailed it. There's two. An incredible win for Trick. Here is your winner. Trick wins. Surprising upset as Trick Williams gets his arm raised here. I don't know if Hayes' ego can withstand this one, guys. He's got to be feeling a little betrayed by Trick right now. Introducing the challenger from the Isle of Samoa, weighing in at 279 pounds, Jacob Belts. And his opponent from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, the World Wrestling Champion. You can see it in the eyes of each individual. Only razor sharp focus when this much is on the line. And there's an argument to be made that defending the title is even harder than winning it, wouldn't you say? Absolutely. You've got your name in the history books. Now it's about what kind of legacy you're going to leave. And that comes down to how you respond to your challengers. And responds with a counter of their own. Going for it. Trying to step through. Roll on their belly. Got him turned over. Trying to find a way out. Using his power to escape. And he sends him into the corner. He saw it coming, taking advantage. DDT. Obviously, submission match rules favor a certain kind of competitor, but what does it take to win? Proper training. You know the sports part of sports entertainment? A submission match is a test of skill. You better know your stuff if you want to come away with a win. The amount of force behind that is enough to knock a normal person out. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Able to elude it. He is looking to do some serious harm. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Gunther catches him by surprise. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. A kick right to the midsection. This ought to be good. What power! Power oh. bomb! Boy, wait a minute. Not done yet? Samoan drop! He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Rocked with a headbutt, but not done yet. A second one. Boom! That was a vicious display. You can almost see the disdain in their eyes. Down with the Samoan drop. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Climbing the 
turnbuckle now. Showing him what a real alpha male looks like. Ooh, man! The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Just caught flush. The champ not looking great right now. Yeah, Cole, and now's the time you need to slap a submission on your opponent before they get one. Well, it's gonna happen. Swanton bomb. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Oh my God! Dummy Musa, we could have a new champion. Uh oh! Oh, ah, what a counter! Here comes the pitch. Oh, run! He drop. They get him speed off the rope. Oh, a hip drop and a gut. Gunther has that determined look on his face. Uh-oh. He catches Guther with a big counter. Side set on the top rope. From the top. Oh, look at that splash. Oh, it's on. Uh-oh. We're going to hyperdrive. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Back into the ring. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Oh my god. Oh, misses the mark. Well placed kick. Just punched him right in the middle. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. You might get caught. Rip it at the eyes. Oof. Lands the haymaker. Muscles up their opponent. Been driven down with Emerald Flosion. Now that is why they're the champ. It's not even a challenge. Hold on a second. Could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. Dragon Sleeper applied. And Clever escape. Luthez press, raining down right hands. You have to respect these men for taking it to the next level. This one's becoming too close to call. Yeah, it's hard to predict how this one will end. Climbing up top, he's got big plans. He's reminding his competition that they'll only at... Maybe that will set him up. Grabbing a hold of the wrist here. Hey, that's a creative way to use your head. Answer after answer for each other's offense here. Taking this one back to the ring now. Held in a perilous position. Snake eyes! Good night. Ooh, well measured. Blocked the effort and cut them off with a shot to the gut. Oh! Flubbing blow. He's able to sidestep there. Oh, running Hurricane Rana. Climbing up to the top now. Oh my god! Missed the mark. Gunther wants to finish this. Driven down with the power bomb. That's and here we go. The Boston Crack. Amazing display of leg strength. No surprise that what we're witnessing is trending. Forget trending on social media. The motion in the arena is charting on the Richter scale. 
No oh, square shot, but the back elbows ends that. Oh, man, look at that gash on Gunther's face. Oh! Oh, targeting the stomach. Oof. Pounding the bread basket. Wasting absolutely no respect on his opponent. You gotta love it. to the floor. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Counters. Off the barricade. Back suplex onto the barricade. testing fate right now. He is truly feeling it right now, as well he should. Oh my goodness, into the power bomb. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing and it could cost him. Gunther moved at the right time. Rings the arm. Nice tight wrist clutch applied and a headbutt. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Gunther can't find a foothold in this match. Perhaps Gunther needs to go back to the drawing board. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Sky high. Splash. in the palm of his hand and he knows it. Working over the body there. Arabian press. Hooked up. Nothing fancy there. Spinning Uranagi. Up to the top rope now. Oh my God. Dami Musa. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Moved at the right time. Oh my goodness! Gunther seems unable to turn the momentum here. Yeah, somehow Gunther has to turn the tide. Mention of Goo Driver! I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Oh my god! He just barely dodges. Net breaker. Very nice. Incredible. 
Setting it up. Oh. Oh. The ring general hitting like the kitchen sink. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. We're at a vital stage in this matchup, and this audience is fully aware of it. Yeah, they know another turning point can come at any second, and that can be the instant that ends it all. This hurts. Oh! New champion! I can't believe it! Here is your winner and new world wrestling champion, Jacob Belts. What a shift into the tides with this championship match. A great blend of tenacity. From New Orleans, Louisiana, weighing in at 200 pounds. Oh, the swagger, the boasting, the downright arrogance of this athlete. Honestly, it's more than I can bear. Good. Feel free to... And from Long Island, New York, weighing in at 223 pounds. Here comes the prize fighter. Kevin Owens is always ready for a fight. And from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. The apex predator is on the hunt. And from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton! The bell rings on this Extreme Rules match. No telling what sort of carnage and destruction we'll see here. When tempers flare and things keep getting pushed further and further, Extreme Rules is the only possible conclusion. Oh! Neckbreaker! Here it comes. Caught with a neckbreaker. Great job refocusing to reverse that. Tagging this outside. This could be good. Reversal! What a count! I think we'll need to find something else to put our trash in around the ring. Because I guarantee that can is going to get all a bit out of shape. Corey, in an Extreme Rules match, what do you think is the best winning strategy? Winning, Corey. In an Extreme Rules match, you basically have to settle for merely surviving. But to answer your question, I'd say stay tough. Never let your opponent see the toll of this especially violent match is taking on you. If you show weakness, it'll only embolden them to strike harder. Snap suplex. Jaw shattering boot. Look at this. DDT. Kneeling. He's looking a little off balance. Yeah, Orton showed there that he still hasn't lost his predatory instinct. That'll turn your lights out. Orton never saw that coming. He steps foot in the ring again. If you're going to grab a kendo stick, you better be prepared to use it. A well-timed dodge. Oh, man, a kendo shot to the head. That can't feel good. And well-timed maneuver there. Can he do it here? He keeps his team in the match. This is gonna be stiff. Back drop suplex. Will this be enough? Getting the shoulder up before two. Still no end in sight here. He thinks he has it. Gets his shoulder up before the two count. Easy kick out there, but they'll give him the suit. Vicious right forearm. Real European uppercut. 
This match's brutality starting to show on him. You ask for extreme, you get extreme. Though this looks like a little more than was bargained for. Left by the turnbuckles. He's one step ahead there. Face first. Counters that. Now this is a textbook example of how to bend the rules. Using the forearm to their advantage. That was just wrong. You should be a better person than that. And it's time to play the game, as they say, with this sledgehammer. Oh, just trying to pound their opponent into the ground even further. Into the pin attempt. And it's Randy Orton able to stop the count. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't enough. He's taking this to the floor now. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extends your elbow. The Viper shows his instinct. Isolating their opponent's arm and oh! Oh, stop right to the hand. You want to control the tempo, you want to dictate the pace. That right there is how you do it. Oh, and a close line to follow. He knew that was coming. In control here with a swinging neck breaker. Textbook. In the ring we go. Setting him up for the flat line. Man, face first. Vicious right forward. He's got a tail. We know where this is going. Here it comes. Stay away from the worm. The tequila. How in the world do you get out of this? I guess just like that. Randy with a counter. Both superstars showing great awareness. Oh, stop! KO can end this now. Stopping the ref's count at two. Almost inhuman at this point. These competitors are pushing themselves beyond their limits. Yeah, it's definitely not every night we see a match like this. Go for the ride. Down to Bowman. And a double axe handle smash. To the outside. This could get wild. Just a step ahead of Owens. Fine uppercut. That'll cost some teeth. Bam! Here comes the trash can for you. And Orton finding himself on the wrong side of the offense there. In order to succeed in an extreme rules match, you have to be willing to sacrifice your body a bit, guys. Sends with the pole to the outside of the ring. This cannot be good because he's got more play. Looking to do as much damage as possible. Nothing fancy, just a straight right. Evading offense. Death pulse. And now unloading rights on his opponent. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. He's reaching under the ring for anything useful. And he's obviously prepared for this as he goes for the ladder. Let's get it on. Punishing the human body. Great reversal. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Randy toying with his opponent a little bit. There's not a single person sitting in this arena. It's pandemonium, Cole. Nicely countered with a hard-hitting DDT. Big plans in mind for the Viper. From the top. Oh, look out. Focusing their attack on the arm. Ooh. Devastating attack from the Viper. Being carried around with ease. Without that candlestick minutes, he is truly willing to go to the end. Now this is going to hurt. Dominator. Oh, this is in some serious trouble. Oh, come on, ref. Get some control. Shut up, Byron. Randy Orton. Nice backbreaker delivered by Orton. I can hardly hear myself. RKO. Randy Orton. There it is. Cover. And the victory. Here are your winners. The team of Penrose and Randy.
And teamwork makes the dream work in this tag team victory. The wrestling gods have truly blessed this union.